We all live in a Focal Bathus headphone. It'll make sense in a minute, I promise. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button so you don't miss any of our awesome audiophile content, including reviews, how-tos, buying guides, and more. So this is the Bathus. Focal's first wireless headphone with active noise cancellation. Wait, haven't they done wireless before? Yes, they had the Focal Listen, but that didn't have active noise cancellation, or ANC. So the word Bathys comes from Bathyscape, which was the first submarine exploration vehicle. So when you think of that level of undersea silence, you understand that this is the perfect name for an active noise canceling headphone. Priced at $7.99, the Bathys has the best sound I've heard from a wireless headphone. What's more, the Bathys offers a lot of flexibility in use scenarios. Sure, you can use the Bathys wirelessly. You could use the Bathys with a portable headphone cable and your phone or a DAP. Or you could put the Bathys into USB DAC mode, connect it to your laptop, and stream high-res music. Yep, you can do that. Now let's take a look at this beauty. It's an elegant black and silver with an aluminum and magnesium construction. A really cool feature is that the center of the ear cups incorporates a white backlight system that you can turn on and off to illuminate the Flame logo. I'll show you how to do that in the Focal Name app in a bit. So on the left ear cup, you have your ANC button. On the right ear cup, you have your volume up and down buttons, a multi-function button, your headphone on and off buttons, plus a USB DAC mode switch, your voice assistant button, USB port, and 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. When you wanna answer an incoming call, you hit the Bluetooth button. Now, while the Bathys is relatively comfortable, I do feel that the underside of the headband could use a bit more cushioning. The headphone has a pretty snug clamp and it's on the smaller side. It weighs 350 grams or just over 12 ounces. For comparison, the Focal Stelia weighs 15 ounces, while the Focal Utopia headphone is just over a pound. Now, the Bathys uses a 40 millimeter aluminum and magnesium driver with M-shaped dome, like the one in the Focal Clear MG and the Celesti headphones. When I started listening to the Bathys, I thought, am I really listening to wireless headphones? Yes, they sound that good, dynamic, detailed, and a touch warm. The sound is on the forward side and it's pretty concentrated in my head. This isn't a wide soundstage scenario. It's a satisfyingly robust sound. This makes the Bathys great for rock and roll and pretty much anything else you listen to. Want to watch movies while you're traveling? The Bathys will give you big, exciting sound that puts you in the middle of the action. Now, if you're familiar with the Focal Celesti, I'd liken the Bathys to that headphone. You can check out our written review linked below for specific sound impressions with different use scenarios. Now let's talk about some of the features on the Bathys. It's got Bluetooth 5.1 multi-point pairing so you can connect two devices simultaneously. The Bathys is compatible with aptX and aptX adaptive high-res codecs as well as SBC and AAC. It's got two noise canceling modes. So silent mode is designed for when you want maximum sound blockage like on an airplane. Now does this mean you won't hear any ambient sound at all? Not necessarily, but noise will be drastically reduced. And with noise cancellation, the louder the outside sound, the more the headphones will be working to block it. The other mode is soft mode, which is recommended when you need to focus, such as while you're working, but you do need to maintain some outside awareness. In this case, outside sounds will be muted, but not canceled. You also have the option of transparency mode, allowing you to hear sounds around you when needed. You're gonna get about 30 hours of battery life when you're in noise canceling mode, 35 hours when you're in jack mode, and about 42 hours in USB DAC mode. 
So I just want to take a moment to show you around the Focal Name app, which is available for iOS and Android. So I've loaded the app onto my phone and paired the Bathys. So it's found the Bathys here. Let's go in. And the first thing we can do is adjust the brightness and turn on and off the backlight uh, on the ear cup there. So it's off, more subtle and fully on. I'm gonna leave it fully on because I think it's so pretty. Um, you can adjust your noise cancellation mode. You've got your silent, your soft and transparent. Of course, you can also use the buttons on the ear cups to make those adjustments. And finally, you've got your six band EQ. I can't uh, access that right now because I need to be streaming music while I do that, but it's there. And it's also gonna show you your battery level. Right now, we're at 70%, which given that I've had this, these headphones on and in use for days, I'd say that's pretty good. And finally, it's gonna display your audio format uh, when you're listening to music and any updates are also gonna come through the app. So that's the Focal Name app. The big thing that sets the Bathys apart from other headphones in this category is that you can connect it directly to a computer, phone, or tablet via USB cable and operate it in USB DAC mode, enjoying 24-bit 192 kilohertz. Now, you're not going to get that on Bluetooth. You'll be getting 44.1. That's still really good. Now, 24192 is pretty good for a wireless headphone, but what if you want something more? Let's say you have DSD files and you need a DAC that will read those. You also want to keep things lightweight and portable. So you could use something like the Claris Coda USB DAC with your phone. Simply turn off USB DAC mode on the Bathys to override its internal DAC. Now let's say you want to stream from your laptop. Ordinarily, you'd use something like the Cord Mojo 2 DAC headphone amp. But since the Bathys has a USB DAC in it, you can plug it straight into your computer via USB cable and stream without Wi-Fi or Bluetooth, and it's going to sound better because you're going to be getting that full 24192 resolution. And if you have higher res files than that, you could use J River to downsample them. Otherwise, they're not going to play. Now, I mentioned that you can up your audio quality game by connecting the Bathys to your phone, tablet, or computer via USB. However, you cannot do this with a DAP. We will go into depth on this in our written review, which is linked below. Now, if you want to switch to a wired connection, we recommend a silver or a Black Dragon portable headphone cable. The Black Dragon, which is what I used, is a silver plated copper cable that offers the sonic strengths of our Silver Dragon and our Bronze Dragon cables. This means you'll get a boost in detail and top end sizzle, along with a boost in the low end. The Silver Dragon would be a good choice if you plan to use the Bathys for more critical listening or if you just want more of a boost in detail and clarity. As for a USB connection, I recommend the Silver Dragon USB cable, which is going to give you a fabulous boost in clarity by ensuring a clean and clear signal path. Now, if you're wondering about other wireless noise canceling headphones that we sell here at Moon Audio, I'll give you a quick comparison here with more in our written review. The Ananda BT can output a higher resolution over Bluetooth than the Bathys can, but there's no option for a wired connection. The Sony WH-1000XM5 has a headphone jack plus superior noise cancellation, while the Sennheiser Momentum 4 has incredible battery life and a headphone jack, but neither has the sound quality or the flexibility of the Bathys, and that's where the Bathys excels. If you like the idea of a wireless active noise canceling headphone, but aren't sure the sound quality will be to your liking, you will be pleasantly surprised by the Bathys. Your choice of ANC modes allows the amount of ambient sound that is suitable for your situation. And the USB DAC mode gives so much flexibility that you're not going to find with other headphones in this category. So what are you waiting for? Go ahead and take a Bathys. Ross and Angel are not amused by my ugly little pun there. <laughs> For more about the Bathys, check out our written review linked below. If you have any questions, leave us a comment. And if you enjoyed this video, be sure to like it and subscribe to our channel. Thanks so much for watching.